Hi, Tim Roberts, Application Engineer with Go Engineer. This quick tip video, I'm going to show some new functionality for sheet metal parts in 2016. We've got a sheet metal part that's been already designed, and we want to look at several things uh, for the weight of the part. Now, the algorithm for mass up until SOLIDWORKS 2016 always would use the geometry from the form part. Okay, so if we look at this, um, it's coming in at 207.1551 uh, grams. Okay, and that's based on the form part. So the new functionality involves the ability to create a custom property. Let's go ahead and create one the old way. Weight of formed part. Okay, and we will link this to our old property of mass. You can see now we have another one underneath it called flattened mass. Okay, so there's our weight, 2071551. Now for new functionality, if we want the weight to be based on the geometry of the flattened part, okay, we now have that option. When we link it, we have a new choice now for flattened mass. Okay, so this is going to do the mass property calculation based on the flat mass. And you can see there is actually a slight difference here out to the uh, second and third decimal place between our weight based on the form part and the weight calculated based on the flat pattern. This is Tim Roberts at Go Engineer. Thanks for watching this quick tip video.